So Google Form add-ons are now live as of a couple weeks ago, and Andrew Stillman's awesome innovation crew at the New Visions Cloud Lab has uh, released Form Ranger. Uh, Jenny Magira did an awesome job showing how you could do form session signups limits using Form Rangers. Um, I go one step further and add one extra column using the unique uh, function. And that way, whenever a session gets full, it actually eliminates that option. So I'm just going to go ahead and um, you should watch Jenny's video. She does an awesome job um, using her uh, same setup from that same session sign up. If you, um, if you add this extra column, the revised session name for form and run that one through form ranger and use the unique of B2B. So it looks at the entire unique of these columns. And my if statement just makes it blank if it is if there's too many in the session count. So instead of me changing it to saying the session's already full, choose another, I just make it blank and then use unique, which would end up populating all my options and making getting rid of the blanks and leaving only the options left that they can select. Um, so essentially the way that you could do that is um, the same setup that Jenny already showed in her video using Form Ranger. And instead of choosing the revised session options, um, what I actually do is I use the revised sessions for forms, uh, revised session name for forms column, the one that uses the unique. Uh, and so you can see that I have that same setup. It's going to repopulate uh, questions on form submit. And um, you can see if I go to the live form, what's going to happen is if um, I choose section one, which has the one person limit and hit submit, then in the spreadsheet, it will uh, allow me to choose session one, but then the if makes it a blank when it reached the session limit. And so this column has the uniques where it'll, it'll if that me means once there's more than one session that goes out, it'll this unique will eliminate what um, options I can do. And so that way now when I go back to my form, if I say submitted another response, it only shows me the things that I'm allowed to choose. Uh, so that for me uh, helps with the teachers or Anybody who wants to sign up and they still want to choose the option that they can't uh, so that doesn't allow them to choose options that are full anymore So it's just one extra uh, Column and I just add it to the left where I do a unique and I make the option blank instead of saying uh, This session is full. Please choose another so it's another way to help uh, Alleviate any problems that teachers or anybody who was signing up for sessions might have um, I try to make things as foolproof as possible and that not allowing them to choose they can't help limit those. So thanks. Hopefully you find it helpful and please watch Jenny's awesome video uh, using Andrew's amazing Form Ranger uh, form add-on. Thanks. Bye.